Hello there, Chris here. Welcome to the Game Player channel. Um, this is my first video, so, uh, well, let's do it. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up hybrid physics in your Windows PC. Um, it is worth mentioning that it is only going to be useful to play certain games like Borderlands 2 and the pre-sequel Alice Madness Returns, Batman and some other games that I put in the description. Um, so please, do not buy an NVIDIA hardware specifically for physics. You'd be wasting your money as it is only supported by some, some games. Um, if you already have an NVIDIA GPU lying around, so this is for you. Well, uh, let's get started. So, for using hybrid physics, you need, obviously, an NVIDIA card with at least 32 shader cores and 256 megabytes of VRAM to take some benefit from GPU physics. So, um, an 8600 GT or above should do the job, but don't expect it to be fast. And, uh, of course, you need an AMD GPU for rendering. I'm using a 7970 for rendering and a 9800 GT as a physics processing unit. Um, this is going to prove more useful for those with dual core processors, um, in, in my opinion. In this case, it is going to be definitely faster than the CPU. Haven't tested though with some newer CPUs and newer um, NVIDIA GPUs, um, but I guess the drivers won't work. I don't know. But anyway, so first thing you want to do is uninstall all your graphics drivers. Uh, this is going to prove uh, um, safer, you know, it's definitely gonna work. So you're gonna use display driver uninstaller uh, that can be found in guru3d.com, I left the link uh, for it in the description. So open up DDU, it will ask you to reboot into safe mode. Say yes, then uninstall your drivers by choosing the card manufacturer at the top of the screen. Um, for your NVIDIA drivers, you can press the Clean and Do Not Restart button, as it, as it is not being used for primary display adapter, uh, I guess. And for your AMD card, use Clean and Restart. So, back to Windows, go to your AMD driver installer package, double-click it and install the drivers normally. Next, you're going to install your NVIDIA drivers. Um, for this, you need the version 306.97, link in the description. Uh, when installing, do not install the PhysX system software that comes with the driver yet. Uh, actually, don't install it at all. Um, so, uncheck it. Now that the driver is installed, don't hit restart yet. Uh, right click on the prehybrid.exe. Select Run as Administrator, now install Physics System Software version 9.13.0725 and reboot the system. Back to Windows, right click on Hybridis.exe, Run as Administrator, remember that, and that's it. You have set up Hybrid Physics. To check it, open up uh, GPU-Z and you see the Physics box ticked. So uh, that's it. Thanks for watching, hit the like button if you liked the video and subscribe for more geeky videos like this. Also leave a comment to let me know what kind of video you'd like to see. See ya!